It's time to go cut some cauliflower. Looking down the road, you would never think the cauliflower is ready. That's what's great about this variety, which is the name of it is amazing. No, really, <laughs> that's the name, amazing. We have to actually move the leaves to open it up. And there it is, hidden inside. Okay, let's see if we can get down in here and cut it. I'm going to remove some of these leaves so we can see better. That's a beautiful head of cauliflower. Let's see if we can find another one. There it is. I didn't count them, but I'd say there was about eight, maybe ten heads of broccoli there. Each head was about six inches across. Uh, I could have left them on the plant a little longer, the heads would have gotten much bigger. But like broccoli, bigger isn't necessarily any better. Uh, this cauliflower is going to be tender. It can be cut up and eaten raw with some ranch dressing. Very good. Uh, we're going to take them inside the house. Once they're in the house, we'll uh, wash them, we'll cut them up, and we'll wash them again. Then we'll put them in boiling water for about five minutes just to blanch them, and they'll be put in plastic freezer containers. Uh, they won't, the containers won't be filled to the top. We'll leave about an inch from the top and cover them with uh, filtered water. Uh, covering them with water will make them last forever in the freezer. Keeps them from freezer burning. And when we're ready, we can take out a pack of cauliflower. We can take out a pack of broccoli and make a cauliflower and broccoli casserole out of this world. Until next time, we'll be seeing you.